I don't know why I'm on the floor and not sitting on the couch. I also don't know what this little piece of hair hanging down is, but it's it's all just happening right now, so we're just gonna go with it. It is me, the kid who just basically turns his channel into a back to school channel for the months of July and August. So here we are, back to school, another back to school video. What I'm actually bringing for college because apparently people care. I don't know why, but apparently people care. I really, I. <laughs> I don't know what is going on right there. Hi, anyways, what's up? How are we? Yeah, I mean, back to school, I go back to college in nine days. I cannot wait. I, it's like I'm counting down the days. Not really though. I'm gonna miss my family, obviously, but college is is the best. There's nothing, nothing better than college, there's nothing better. But anyways, welcome back to another video, Collegian. How are you today? Um, Yeah, the summer sucked. I did nothing, so that was, that was fun. And now it's finally time to go back. Am I excited? Yes. That bad to say? No. Let's begin the video with just getting this out of the way. This video is sponsored. I mean, come on. This video is sponsored. And it's sponsored because I'm trying to make sure that me and you look fitted going to this back to school. So today, sponsor, as I get up, don't look my butt, is Blundstone Boots. If my mother ever found out that I put my foot on the couch, she would be furious. But thank God she doesn't watch my videos. So yeah, Bloodstone boots. I got a little outfit on right now. I got, I got my joggers on. I got a t-shirt. And I got these. This would be a good like going to class outfit. Like I'm really proud of this little outfit that I got going on. Bloodstone is sponsoring today's video. Here they are. Look at them. Beautiful. These are the 1306 Chelsea boot in rustic brown. I was never a big boot guy and then I got these. And I was actually like, I've been wearing them just every day, to be honest. They also give me about two inches more of height, which I need every inch I can get. Yeah, I love them. Clearly, you can fit them in a bunch of different outfits. I demonstrated on my TikTok, which I will show a few videos here. I demonstrated like wearing them, you know, family weekend, maybe a tailgate, maybe going out. There's a bunch of different occasions you can use. Their website's great. There's a bunch of different options. Just go on the link in my bio. And yeah, just get back to school with them. Look styling just like I do. I can't promise you will look as good as I do in the boots, but I mean, it's it's a possibility. I mean, look at this. Look at these. Kidding me? Bang, bang these things. Flexible too. Whoa. How could you look that good? You can't. I mean, really, you can't. Anyways, moving into the rest of the video. Let me demonstrate what I'm bringing back to school with me. Because I have a giant pile over here. Ready? Look at this. I have, like, everything is just layered over there. I don't even know. This video is honestly just going to be me packing for school. And I'm just going to film it. Most importantly, honestly, you got to have the decorations. Check this out. This is from my buddy, Matt Cook. Graduated my fraternity last year. You know, Red Sox with their World Series rings. That will be hanging in my room soon. That's coming to school. This decoration, which someone made for me, you can open things with this. This is gonna go on my wall. And those are my fraternity letters, actually, believe it or not. Sigma Beta. The only fraternity, the only singular Sigma Beta is at the University of New Hampshire, and I am part of that fraternity as, I mean, you've definitely seen videos of that if you've been watching my channel for a little bit. I'm living there again. It's gonna be a house full of about 35 guys, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be insane. So I'm excited for that. But yeah, that is coming to school. That's another decoration. You really gotta decorate your room. It's a big deal. This thing, which I bought at the dollar store and put my friend's ID in it. I don't know why, but that's there. And a bunch of signs. COVID, Regina Pizza, another Boston one. I don't know. They ignore that. That is having stuff to style your room is pretty important. I won't lie. Like having a bunch of blank walls looks stupid. These are so stupid, but I don't know. Got some towels. I don't really know where else to go with that. I mean, I got hand towels right here. I got some shower towels. Only three of them. Um, that should last me like a semester. This is like all of my bedding. Uh, this I think is for bud bed. Bed bugs. I got my shower shoes. These are stylish. They're almost as stylish as Blundstone, but not really. No, I'm kidding. Blundstone is fire. These are absolute trash. These are like, these are just like, so you don't get toe fungus and whatever else is in the bathroom showers. I don't know. And then you got the all important shower caddy right here. Just throw, you know, soap, shampoo, whatever you use to shower, you know, wash it whatever you're washing. These are essential. I can't lie. Do not go to college road either of these. You will be screwed. Do not be the guy or girl that showers barefoot in the communal shower because that is disgusting. There's no way around. It's disgusting. It's just, you, you need help. I don't know why I'm stacking this all here. I'm gonna move this. I told you last video you need a bunch of socks. I wasn't lying. This is like not even half the amount of socks I'm bringing. Trust me. You're gonna run through a lot of socks. It's a thing that happens. I don't really know why. And then Tide Pods. This is, this is huge. Do you see? This is the size bigger than my head. And my head is huge. Don't eat them. That's not good. I know that's my generation that ate them. So, so don't do that. But Tide Pods, yes, these are... These are good, these are great. You need these, these are so easy. I mean, you're gonna do laundry. I am kind of 
insane and do laundry like multiple times a week. I see kids do it like once every three weeks. Laundry's important, so yeah. Now check this bad boy out. You're gonna say, what's that? Uh, it's a container. See? It's a container. I don't really know this. So this is good because you need a lot of storage. What they give you, like the dressers and like the closets, is not enough to fit everything. I've had these since freshman year and now going into junior year. I bring three giant storage containers that just go right under my bed and it just, it's so helpful. I just pull them out. One of them's like medicine. One of them's a bunch of miscellaneous random stuff. And another one I just throw like, you know, soap, shampoo, stuff like that in there. And I just, good to kind of have that so you can like know where things are. What else do we got? Oh my. Okay, this one should be fun. I just have bins and bins of clothes. I bring way too many clothes. I could wear a different outfit every day of the week for a full year and I wouldn't run out of clothes. So, first and foremost, obviously the fraternity shirt. Like, the amount of fraternity shirts that I have is not even funny. This bin is just like sweats and shorts and just, ah, oh, I can't, I'm not even, I can't do this right now. I'm getting anxiety. I'm not doing that now. Nope. No, 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 no. Whoa. What is this? Apparently I got a Keurig. My mother got this for me. A coffee maker, a Keurig. This is honestly great. I had no idea this was coming with me, but it is apparently. It was in my college pile, so now I'm stealing it. Thank you, Mom. This is a great idea because I get a coffee every day of the week. There's a Dunks, literally a two minute walk from my house. It's painful to spend $5 a day on a coffee. It's, it's just, it's so not good, especially when you're buying, you know, other things for the weekend. You can't really buy a $6 coffee every day. So it's either stop drinking it, which, Ain't gonna happen. Or get a coffee machine like this. I like iced coffee. This is, I think, hot. I don't know, it's like Christmas. I can't wait to use this. You think it comes with the, the Cinnabons? I got anything else to show you over here? Maybe not, I don't know. Ugh. Break into this bin and see what we got. Okay, Ziploc bags. You probably don't need those. Q-tips that have never been opened. That should not, that is a hit at my hygiene that just, it, I have clean ears, I promise. Um, I don't, I, there's no excuse why these aren't open, I'm sorry. This is huge, a lint roller. I'm not even kidding, it's, it's, it's such. See, it just gets, there's no lint. I said this last video, you probably didn't watch it because no one watches these anymore, but a lint roller is huge. Deodorant, so you don't smell. Do you think, and, and let's just be honest here, do you think the people that smell like B.O. know that they smell like B.O.? You gotta be, some people smell, and, and it's just how, it's like four bucks at like Target. Like I don't even, it, this is not a luxury. This is huge. Uh, Lysol. You don't know what is gonna spill or what is gonna in your door. Like things just happen and you gotta have Lysol that's huge. Silverware. This is, that you would not believe this is huge. Silverware is a big deal. Bring silverware and, and yeah, you need, these are just knives. Um, you know, if there's an attacker, you could use this, but I don't recommend it. I don't know what else to tell you. I mean, you're gonna be okay as long as you don't go to school in literally the middle of nowhere. I promise you, there will be a, like a store that you can go and buy stuff. These are just kind of the essentials. You know, you want decorations for your room. You want shower shoes so you don't get a fungus. You want like the stupid stuff like that. I'm trying to think of that. Oh, a bunch of medicine. You don't know how many times you're gonna get sick. It's insane. I go through like a box of Dayquil a month, which isn't, is it healthy? No, but neither am I. So it can't, it like, it balances out. Really though, you do want a ton of medicine. I live in a fraternity house. Do you know how many people are there every weekend? Like you're just gonna get sick. It's just a thing. All right, that's it. I'm done. Okay, I retire from YouTube completely. That's a joke. I'm gonna be making videos on 40. That is gonna be all for today's video. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. It was a calm kind of video because by the end of next week, I will be back at a fraternity house. So the calm videos won't last for a long time, I promise. We'll be back to the crazy fraternity videos very soon. But thank you again to Blundstone for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys for watching and back to college in a week. Make sure you like the video, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, join the Collegiate, and I will see you guys back at the fraternity house. <laughs>
I don't like that. I don't like sitting like that. Oh, can I start filming like this? Would you guys care if I just like laid down?